Hello everybody, welcome to the Scottish Geeks. Today we're going to be playing Thief. Yes, no, 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 not the new one, no, no. This is an indie title and indie horror game. Uh, it's a trial version, it's uh, just came out in Game Joel, so let's give it a try, shall we? I don't know what to expect. Oh, what's this? Okay. So, uh, as you can tell, it's a pixelated horror style game, and uh, very pixelated in fact. So I have no idea where I'm going. But don't worry, I'm sure we'll find the way. Where are we going? It's very, very dark. I can't actually see anything I'm meant to be seeing, but uh, so we're in the building now. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna find out what we need to do. What's this? It's Mona Lisa. So to collect money, but ba money bags. Hello. Where are you? Okay. So I'm gonna try and find some bags of money. Uh, it would help if I could actually see what the hell's going on, but yeah, atmospherically it's quite good. So that's a seated figure. I'm assuming that's a TV with the Mona Lisa on it because it's quite big. Uh, right, no, I I don't know where I'm going. Ah, here we go. Okay, we go this way. Anybody here? Oh, I'm getting beeps and bips and another painting. So yes, anyway, uh, like I said, this is a pixelated horror game, a little too pixelated if you ask me, uh, in which I've got to find bags of money. And this should be around here somewhere. So I've been on one side of the house, I can't really find anything. So there's a side door here, there's nothing in there. I can't see a bloody thing. I don't know what's going on. Right up to there. Clear. Right around the front of the house. Same do around here. All the doors are all blocked off. No, I, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I can jump though. So, we're around here somewhere. It's kind of like... Um, I think what's happened is they've probably made the game properly in a pixelated style, but then they've actually over pixelated it, which is. I don't know, I, I don't like that very much. I think it's. I'm stuck. Alright, okay, I've got to jump up the stairs. Um, I'm not really keen on the, on the style, if I'm completely honest with you. It's uh, too much. Oh, I've got money back. Yay! One bag of money. One bag of money. So, yeah. Hello. Who are you? Some person over there. Who are you? What the? Where did he go? He disappeared somewhere. Of where I do not know. What's wrong with my camera? Something. Strange is happening in the world today, of which I do not know. I'm gonna keep saying that, I don't know why. But, uh, yeah. So, there's gonna be another way to go. There's gonna be another way. Let's head out to the balcony again. So, potentially, you should be able to. Uh, I don't know, I find it really difficult to see where I'm going. Um. It's the sort of game where I would turn around and I would say, you know, I might not record this after all, but I think purely just for the, for my own curiosity, I, I kind of want to see where this is going. Um, but in the same respects, I'm not enjoying it that much. Uh, is, this, is this more money? No. Around the other side of the house. But, uh... Yeah, there's no clear indication of what I'm meant to be going. The pixelation is too much. It really is. It's far too much pixelation. So now I'm outside of the house and I'm 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 outside the fence now. With no indication of where I'm meant to be going. Ah, uh, I'll give it another couple of minutes. Let's see. Atmospherically, the sound effects pretty damn good, but sound effects do not make a game great, no. It has to be a combination of various different aspects of it, and to be fair, what I'm getting from this just now is someone has just thought to themselves, well, pixelated horrors are doing pretty well just now, so 
Um, I'm going to take this pixelated game I've made and make it even more pixelated, and it's just not working for me. It really isn't. I don't know about you guys. I mean, I, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. If any of you, any of the rest of you had any experience with this game at all, um, do you know what's meant to happen with it? Do you know where we're meant to be going? And I don't know. Leave some comments for me below, and just let me know what you think of it. Because to be completely honest with you. This game is not enticing me to keep playing. There's no danger element for one thing. I have a knife which goes up and down. It doesn't appear to be attached to anything actually. I collected one money bag in the whole of that section. There was a lot of places where I got completely stuck. Now I do realise this is still beta. So I I, I was like, oh, hang on, what happened there? Had a bit of daylight there. That would be good. That should have stayed there. But no, I've been around that whole complex, the only thing I could think of. Okay. Now I'm a police officer. Can I can I go in the car? What's this over here? A red line. See now I'm intrigued. Now I am intrigued. I'm gonna follow this line and see where it takes me. That first section, no, that, that I nearly stopped playing because of that first section. What have we got here? A body. So see, the note reads, unfortunate thief. Hello. I don't have any bullets. So that was me. I died and apparently now I'm the police officer who's coming to investigate what's going on. Yeah, I, colour me intrigued again. Colour me intrigued again, but still, still. I'm not 100% convinced yet. There's going to be something pretty special in here that's going to convince me um, that this game is anything other than just an attempt to make a pixelated adventure that's been over pixelated. It's too dark, we need more light. Um, I mean, fair play if the guy decides at some point he's going to, you know, make it a little bit better. But at the moment, I'm kind of. There we go. I'm kind of, I'm kind of, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed. Open. Open. No, oh, I can't go through that way. No, shite. Okay, well, there's going to be another way in here. Yeah, I know the, the note reads Unfortunate Thief, but at the moment, no, no, I'm not. I'm not convinced. Um, but like I said, I could be missing the point. I could be. Is that, I think I think that's meant to be lightning. I think it is. But uh, let's go check out the house again. I don't I don't understand this. Up oh, here we are at the house. I mean that shadowy figure. That shadowy figure. I don't know what he was it was all about. But uh, here we are. That's where we started. Hello. Bang, 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 bang. Uh, okay, well the Mona Lisa appears to be a skull now. No, I'm I'm not getting this. I'm really not. Is there anything you guys think I should be doing that I haven't tried yet? No, nope, nobody in here. Because, in all fairness, I could be, I could be playing something else. I could be. No, I'm sorry, um... Psh, nah. Nah. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop this in just a second or two. No, I'm sorry, but uh, Thief, unfortunately for me, does not come across as a game that is gonna attract my attention, is gonna make me wanna keep playing in it. Um, kudos to the guy for making it, as I couldn't do it myself, uh, but unfortunately, not my kind of thing. If there's an update, let me know, and um, I will certainly give it another try, but for what it is right now, there's nothing to keep me playing. Thank you so much for watching, please leave your comments below on what you think of the game yourself, and I'll catch you in the next episode. But until then, bye bye